Welcome to Pink Digital News. This video is about Corium's DevNet update, WASM smart contracts and gas price calculations. What we knew about Corium a few months back is not what we know now. Corium was a fast, interoperable, and scalable layer one blockchain. Now let's fix that up real quick. Corium is the first EGB, a new generation of blockchains that is geared towards enterprise needs to provide fast, coefficient, scalable, and interoperable blockchain infrastructure in compliance with the ISO 20022. Following Corium's roadmap, by the way, according to Corium's roadmap that was scheduled for August 2022, we are now almost at the end of September. We are a little bit late, but better late than never. So following Corium's roadmap, the Sologenic Development Foundation had announced that the DevNet of the new Layer 1 was updated on September 19 to support WASM smart contracts and gas price calculations. Along with the update, Date, Corium reveals the capability of its distributed ledger technology solutions for all enterprise needs. Now, what we have is the Enterprise Graded Blockchains EGB. Corium alludes to a new standard for blockchain networks, specifically designed to provide essential tools and infrastructure for businesses of any size so that they are able to build, incorporate, and run decentralized applications. In compliance with ISO 20022, some key elements EGB blockchains bring are security, scalability, efficiency, and optional KYC to suit regulators' requirements when it comes to the heavily regulated financial sectors. Furthermore, if an enterprise chooses to refrain from using the KYC feature during development, the Corium blockchain provides entirely anonymous transactions by default. Now, the WebAssembly is a key element of Corium scalability, supporting multiple programming languages and providing a more extensive set of tools than the popular Ethereum virtual machine EVM allows developers to write smart contracts in whichever language they are most comfortable with, including Rust, CC++, TypeScript, and Kotlin. Moreover, by leveraging the advantages of compiled code, Wasim is able to load and execute smart contracts faster, while also increasing the number of transactions processed per block. Now, this update will allow projects to start building on the blockchain as the first wave of Corium grantees has been selected. With this first wave of grants centered around DeFi protocols, wallet applications, and PR requests, we should expect these projects to launch a Along with the Corium mainnet in Q1 2023. Wave 2 applications will be opening soon and all documentation for developers is available on the Developers Hub section of the website. On another note, it is important to consider Corium has not performed any token sales and aims to be an entirely community-driven technology. A monthly airdrop of core tokens is being allocated to solo holders and 30% more of the total supply will be distributed to the core community in the future as well. According to co-creator of Corium, Bob Rass. He stated that at the present time, blockchain technology has not been adopted on a large scale by the traditional finance sectors. There is a lack of layer one blockchain protocols that directly address and solve financial sectors' regulatory concerns while providing secure, fast, coefficient, and scalable transactions. The first blockchain to solve these concerns will potentially change the game forever. Now, what are the key attributes of EGB networks? Compliance with ISO 20022 requirements, real-time settlements with transaction details while not exposing confidential details of parties and subjects involved, provision of an optional KYC feature on-chain, immutability and irreversibility through cryptography, utilization of triple entry accounting and consensus systems to establish asset ownership, ability to set transaction-specific business rules, provision of 1,500 transactions per second as a minimum, having on-chain interoperability capability and cross chain bridge to other blockchains. Use of a secure, electronic and timestamp transaction ledger database shared by all parties in a distributed network. Comprisal of accurate and verifiable records for all transactions ever made. Cryptographic peer-to-peer -peer networks and smart contracts. Now, we're going to look at some of the potential use cases of EGB networks in financial markets. And these are commercial banking, payments, risk management, trade and supply chain finance, capital markets, and regulatory compliance. We will be following up all the developments as they happen and update you accordingly. Please let me know in the comments if you would like me to do a separate video on enterprise graded blockchains, EGB. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more updates and like and share this video. Thank you for tuning in. Paint Digital News, signing out.